is we're here at the Intermediate to interview some Murites about how they're feeling about the college. Hi, I'm Maxwell. I'm here with Adele, Georgia, and Ella. And Hi, I'm Jesse, and this is Blair and Toby. Hi, I'm David. I'm here with Sophie, Sophia, and Sophia. And Hi, I'm Sophia, and I'll be interviewing Logan, Erin, and Justin. I'm here with Pippa, Tristan, and Chris, and I'm going to be asking them the questions. What will you miss about the intermediate? Um, probably some of the teachers and student council. Teachers, definitely. Yeah, um, I'm going to miss the specs and I'm going to miss our class because our class is really cool. I'm going to miss all the year sevens I've met throughout the year and all the academies here. I'm going to miss staying in the same class all day and I will miss being a child. Yeah. Uh, probably the teachers. Uh, well, it's intermediate, so you've got one teacher for most of the stuff. I might miss just having one teacher that I know well. Sport and rugby and all my friends. Um, all the days off playing sport. Um, probably a small school. Got them to help into our colleges. Probably being able to know everyone because it's quite a small school. Uh, just not having as much work and stuff like that. And we're going to ask them what subjects they're looking forward to next year. English. <laughs> I'm excited for social studies and PE. Science. Yes. <laughs> Hockey kind of subject. Yes, sir. Um, sports teams like PE and English. English and dance. Nice. English, dance and drama. Dance and art. Um, the woodwork and music band and technology. Nice. Um, woodwork, PE and science. Choices, yeah. Uh, probably math. Nice. Math, science, and probably more technology side of things. Right, nice. I'm not too sure. Fair enough. Yeah, I'm going to be asking, what are your expectations for next year? I think it'll be a lot more challenging. I think we're definitely going to get lost. <laughs> I don't know. Probably it's going to be different to how it's immediate, how going to different classes and having different teachers. Each day, yeah. Um, I think it will be a big step up with like more people and having to change classes like often. Um, I think it's going to be quite different because there'll be a lot of more sports to play and like heaps more classrooms. There. I'm not really sure, but it's going to be different because we're moving around classes instead. Uh, choosing all your own subjects and going to classes. Yeah. I'm going to expect to be lost a lot. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to be, expect to be lost a lot as well. <laughs> I'm expecting to be lost a lot as well. <laughs> asking them, um, what are some stories you've heard about Tower College? A uh, particular science teacher I got for the open morning thing was the best one apparently. Uh, that the dance department and dance teachers are really good. Um, that the classes are really fun. Well, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> um, I've heard that there's heaps of different sports to play. Yeah. I haven't really heard anything about it. That's all good. There's a mini Mr. Westfall, apparently. Alright. <laughs> a mini Mr. Westfall. Alright. <laughs> yep, a mini Mr. Westfall. <laughs> I'm going to be telling you some tips about Tower College. Tip one, don't go to Red Doors. Tip two, reflect, respect, strive, connect. Did I do that in the right one? <laughs> <laughs> Don't blast music in the hall. Bad things happen. Okay, tip four. Join Phil Club and watch TC News. See you later. See ya. <laughs> what stories have you all? <laughs>